It's a fact that you want to stay fit when you're in the big game, but sometimes for NFL players, they take it too far. You'll know what we mean in a bit. In today's videos, we're going to be talking about the biggest freaks of nature currently in the NFL. So without further ado, let's get right into it. George Kitty. As we all know, George Kitty is famous for being one of the best blocking tight ends, but that is not all there is to him. He's an all-rounder and is literally skilled at everything you could think of. Needless to say, he is one of the best players that the NFL has, a great receiver, the guy with the most touchdowns, one of the tallest and fastest players ever, you literally name it. He is 6'4", and literally in his second season, he was able to break all the tight end records. The dude literally nailed it and then led all of the players on the field. He really is the only one of his kind, and we can't deny that. Like, imagine having a person putting no effort to simply jump and touch a 12-foot ceiling. Yeah, sounds easy, sure, but try doing it sometime. With his ripped arms and tight muscles, you too could believe that he could literally do anything. You would be surprised that after finishing his university, he was still looked over by 32 teams. The lost was honestly theirs. Like, come on, who would want to miss out on a gem like this? He was drafted in the fifth round of 2017 and then literally crushed the game and its records. If you think this player was impressive, wait till you find out more about the next one. Julio Jones Of course, the one and only. The guy right here has shown so many extraordinary habits and tendencies that by this point, they could have gotten used to his unbelievably good and absurd skills. When the best athletes are discussed, they certainly make sure to put his name on the list as well, and for good reason. He's also known for the infamous catch he made at the end of one of his games, and even though the Falcons lost, the catch was legendary and nobody except him could have been able to do that. He is 6'3 and weighs around 220 pounds, and it won't be an overstatement to call him one of the most intimidating receivers ever, because he surely is. And let's not even go to his speed and running skills. It would be a nightmare for the other players if they ever have to catch up to him, because it is nearly impossible. The dude just won't let you get to him no matter how fast of a runner you might be. Like, come on, he earns a 96% average when it comes to receiving yards in games. An athlete with a great average and all the skills he could possibly need along with it really makes him the perfect candidate for the Hall of Fame. You're probably really impressed right now, but get ready to be blown away by the next player we have on the list. Khalil Mack There's literally only one thing you need to know about Khalil Mack. He's got it all. Not only is he a great player, but he's also simply superior to all of his opponents. Whether it is physically or athletically, no one can drag him down, and he knows that. He first played at the Buffalo University, which is a flex in itself. He has spent his time just being both a bear and a raider, and honestly, he was just good at both times. And the muscle power that he has is crazy. He could literally lift the other players on the field, including several offensive linemen. Just imagine that. In one game, he was able to sack off Tristan Wirtz on the field, and then did the same thing with another quarterback. So, I guess we can assume that he doesn't come slow. An actual freak of nature with all of his great and unmatchable power. Like, come on, he's even the master of the rush as well, and has the best rush in the whole NFL. When it was his first night on the Chicago Bears, he really put on a show for the whole audience to see when he snatched out the ball from the quarterbacks and became the cornerstone of the Bear franchise. And it is pretty obvious by now we hope to see that he's really famous with his fans. Okay, stop right there for a moment. If you're enjoying the video so far, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Also, subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss out on any of our latest uploads. Now, let's get back to the video. The next player we have on our list is none other than Lamar Jackson. So Lamar is on this list for reasons more than one. One of them is that he is the fastest player in the entire league. It is perhaps easier to tackle the win than it is to ever get close to him when he is on the run. Other than that, he is a very strong player who cannot be easily tackled. He has been the one using his ability around which the Ravens have built their entire offense. And whatever the circumstance is, he can just either slither past his opponents like it's nothing. A lot of people say that when he runs, it looks like you're watching a video on twice its actual speed. He just doesn't know how to be mediocre. And to make things even scarier than his opponents, he has an arm made of steel. Or at least that's what it feels like when he throws a ball like that. Not many other people are able to come up to his level no matter how hard they try. One player though was able to do that, and that is Michael Vick. But even then, he was completely destroyed by Lamar soon enough. 
one might just believe that his abilities are freakily amazing. Up next is another player that is going to blow your mind away. DK Metcalf For most people, his name would be enough to be intimidating by him. But there are so many other reasons as well that we're going to be mentioning in a bit. Like, come on, he's literally addressed as a monster when it comes to strength and game. But first of all, let's talk about the way the guy is built. Normal humans can't possibly look like that. All we can say is that man had to get a body that is like this is not an easy task. And all in honesty, if everybody started looking like that, no one would ever wear a shirt again. Moving on, Metcalf stands at a 6'3 and weighs about 228 pounds. And guess what? With only 5% body fat. <sighs> Oh, and did we mention the fact that he's also one of the fastest receivers out there? Because he surely is. Equalities just never seem to end with this one. Do they? He's a great runner. He even leaves the running backs behind. He has a great leap and usually works great at corners and cannot be stopped. The list is never ending. He's also the only player with 27 reps on a bench press. You got it, he is a record maker. If you don't believe in higher beings, we'll just take a moment to look at this guy. Surely one of nature's freaks, and in the best way possible. Aaron Donald Imagine being told that you will never survive in the league because you're too small, but then blowing everyone's minds away by showcasing your extraordinary and mind-blowing skills. You got it. That is exactly what happened with Aaron Donald. That man is literally built like Hercules now. Or Hulk. Whatever feels more relevant. But like, you get the idea, right? And that isn't all. He even broke the 40-yard dash record and was able to do it in less than 4.6 seconds. What's even more impressive is that he doesn't let anybody get to him. Even though, and even when, he is in the middle of a game, he just cuts through the group of opponents like a no big deal. And let's be honest, for him, it's a piece of cake. Do you think that it was possible to have just the right amounts of speed and strength both? Well, you will have to, because that is what Aaron Donald is. The perfect blend. Anyways, he has been seen lifting grown men on the field like they were just a bunch of kids. No wonder he's on the list of being the biggest NFL freaks of nature. He's just something else. Anyways, that is all for today's video. If you liked it, make sure to hit the like button and for more content like this, subscribe to our channel and in the comments, let us know what you thought about the video. Thank you for watching.